Good afternoon, I'm Alicia Smith. Here are your headlines from 7 Action News. The Detroit Lions have announced they plan to have Ford Field at full capacity for all home games in 2021. It'll be the first time since 2019 that the stadium will be full after not being open to the public in 2020 for the games. The team made the decision after working with local and state officials and citing COVID-19 vaccination rates across the state. Fans will not be required to provide proof of vaccination or wear face masks. New developments for the thousands of people who live in Flint affected by the city's water crisis. A hearing is now underway to determine if the state's $600 million settlement will officially be approved. Back in January, a judge gave preliminary approval of that settlement, establishing a process in which families could indicate whether they'd like to file a claim. During the hearing, a judge will listen to arguments and objections to determine if the settlement is fair. A final ruling is expected later on this summer. The first payments in the Biden administration's enhanced child tax credits are due to start rolling out this week. Heads of households will be receiving up to $3,600 for each child up to six years of age and $3,000 for each six to 17 year old. Half of that credit can be claimed when filing income taxes for the year, but the other half will be paid in monthly installments from now through the end of the year unless you opt out. Now those payments can be up to $300 per month for kids under six and $250 a month for kids up to 17. Well, temperatures today with the cloud cover will stay in the 70s. Scattered showers and storms today look to be a little bit more isolated, more numerous tomorrow with temperatures in the low 80s and then hot and humid by Thursday. Highs in the upper 80s, pushing 90.